Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Deus Ex Revision Mod. Uh, I've played the original Deus Ex uh, many times. Uh, I've, I've always wanted to kind of touch upon revision. I've actually LP'd the original for uh, about like five years ago or something, so at this point uh, everybody should have forgotten, I guess, uh, me going through that. Plus this is actually supposed to be very different, very rebalanced, very uh, different environments, things like that. So it's going to be sort of blind in that sense, I don't, I don't really know. Uh, just to show you some settings that we have going on, um, uh, this is not nothing important, uh, this is nothing important either, sorry, where is it? Yeah, we have all this, uh, H HD, uh, models and stuff like that, which should be kind of interesting. Ah, right, here we go, this is the main one. Uh, gameplay style is Biomod. Um, there's three types, there's Normal, Shifter, and Biomod. And Biomod is... Apparently, okay, so Biomod is Shifter on top of that as well, so Shifter does a bit of like, makes the enemy AI a little bit more difficult than some other stuff. And Biomod rebalances augmentations and adds a couple more new mechanics. What? I read some of them, I don't know really, I'm still going into sort of blindish. Um, and that's basically it, so... Um, where's my sound I options? My yeah, I guess we're all good with this. I kept the dialogue up a little bit, so... Um, we're, I'm going to show you actually some of these modifiers. They're actually really funny. Uh, so this one has um, inventory space is halved uh, with tragic code on. Return damage. Any lethal damage done to enemies is returned to the player. So I guess it's just for non-lethal runs or something to force you to do it. One item inventory. You can only carry one item at a time. Uh, no augmentations. You cannot install augmentations. Uh, there's Steam achievements uh, in this one. No items mode. You cannot carry any items at all. <laughs> Um, heavy items. When enabled, items do not stack in the inventory, excluding grenades. Unsatisfactory hardware. All you have, to, all you have is pistol and electric prod. You cannot carry any more items. Uh, fandom bots. All, all robots are cloaked and silent. Or we can have armored enemies. Enemies don't take damage unless, uh, unless they die in one hit. Uh, sudden death. All, any damage an uh, enemy deals to you instantly kills you, even on easy. Small items. Uh, all weapons take up one inventory uh, cell. Uh, that's kind of, so you can't stack items in that one. Cloaked enemies. All enemies are cloaked. Quiet enemies. They don't talk when they hear you or detect you. Prevents robots from making any idle or footstep style, footstep stones. Uh, all weapons are on loud weapons. All weapons are ten times louder to the AI unless silenced. Clean streets. All weapons and ammo on the ground are removed, and all combat crates lose their contents. <laughs> Crazed turrets. All turrets are always on attacking unless changed. It also allows turrets to aim directly below. Short circuit. When enabled, augmentations hurt the player when active. <laughs> Hall of Mirrors. When enabled, all humans look like JC. <laughs> uh, when ena uh, Susa Legends. When, all en when enabled, uh, all MIBs and WIBs run into you detonate instead of using their weapons. <laughs> when, ena uh, when enabled, all fire extinguishers blow up when it's destroyed. Fatal cameras. All Any cameras that activate their alarms cause you to explode. Uh, aviation mode. Uh, when enabled, all enemies can fly. Disables achievements. Zombies. Uh, when enabled, all living enemies will run run into you and detonate. <laughs> Disables all achievements and medbot healing. Uh, enemies have unique properties. That's actually some funny shit. But we're not enabling any of that. We're just playing unrealistic. So, uh, what are we gonna do for this? Um, I want to do. Okay, so my first initial run of this that I did uh, for YouTube was basically like a mix of snipers and. Uh, heavy weapons kind of thing. Uh, I did like rifle and heavy and then I guess some demolition. Didn't focus too much on anything else. Apparently athletics is buffed here though. Running speed, jump height, and swimming performance of the agent increases slightly. It's actually really nice. But anyways, um, we're actually going to go uh, like a more stealthy route. Uh, I've, I'm not doing non-lethal, but I am going to do stealth, uh, which is something I've never done before. So we're going to actually upgrade pistol. And computer was apparently already upgraded. Don't know why that was the case. We have a bit more left in terms of skill points. I don't know what I want to save it on. Maybe we should do athletics, just because that actually seems not so bad anymore. I don't know. No, we'll, we'll save it. We'll save it for something else. Maybe lockpicking or something. Apparently medicine also is much cheaper, too. You heal moderately or energy further reduce the period. But you can heal moderately more damage or energy and further. Oh, okay. Oh, he can, he can heal more damage or energy and reduce the period of toxic poisoning. That's actually really good. But yeah, that, we're not doing anything else here. We can change ourselves. Yeah, we're going to look like normal JC, if you can really say that. 
Your appointment to FEMA should be finalized within the week. I have already discussed the matter with the Senator. I take it he was agreeable? He didn't really have a choice. Has he been infected? Oh yes, most certainly. When I mentioned that we could put him on the priority list for the Ambrosia vaccine, he was so willing it was almost pathetic. This play, the rioting, is intensifying to the point where we may not be able to contain it. Why contain it? Let it spill over into the schools and churches. Let the bodies pile up in the streets. In the end, they'll beg us to save them. I've received reports of armed attacks on shipments. There's not enough vaccine to go around, and the underclasses are starting to get desperate. Of course they're desperate. They can smell their death, and the sound they'll make rattling their cage will serve as a warning to the rest. Hmm. I hope you're not underestimating the problem. The others may not go as quietly as you think. Intelligence indicates they're behind the problems in Paris. A bunch of pretentious old men playing at running the world. But the world left them behind long ago. We are the future. We have other problems. UNATCO? Formed by executive order after the terrorist strike on the statue. I have someone in place, though. I'm more concerned about Savage. He's relocated to Vandenberg. Our biochem corpus is far in advance of theirs, as is our electronic sentience. And their ethical inflexibility has allowed us to make progress in areas they refuse to consider. The Augmentation Project? Among other things, but I must admit that I have been somewhat disappointed in the performance of the primary unit. The secondary unit should be online soon. It's currently undergoing preparation and will be operational within six months. My people will continue to report on its progress. Necessary, the primary will be terminated. We've had to endure much, you and I, but soon there will be order again. A new age. Aquinas spoke of the mythical city on the hill. Soon that city will be a reality and we will be crowned its kings. Not better than kings. Gods. All right, welcome to the game. I know the UI looks a little bit pixelated, but it's either super small or double the size. So I chose double the size. Heads up, JC. Your brother Paul is on his way to meet you at the dock. The NSF is raiding the island and shots have been fired. I repeat, find Paul. I will monitor your situation from HQ. So all this shit is different. Like, for example, I'm pretty sure this shed didn't exist before. Uh, but I think, uh, I think Paul wants a Coke. Paul, I thought you were in Hong Kong. Welcome to the Coalition, JC. I might as well start using your code name. Think I've missed my brother's first day? Didn't think you'd have a choice. What's going on? The NSF. They hit one of our shipments. A few of them got away, but we trapped the rest in the statue. What are we waiting for? Looks like a textbook assault. The NSF took one of our agents hostage. The bots are holding the perimeter, but my orders are to hold back and send you in alone. I think someone high up wants to see how you handle the situation. All I've got with me is a pistol and an electric prod. I don't mind a test, but you NACO better issue some hardware. Remember that we're police. Stick with the prod. It'll stun your opponents or knock them unconscious. A non-lethal takedown is always the most silent way to eliminate resistance. Just in case, though, Manderly wants you to pick an additional weapon. A sniper rifle, a gep gun, or a mini crossbow. It hurts me. I usually always take the rifle, but finally. The crossbow. Sometimes you've got to make a silent takedown. Good thinking. With these tranquilizer darts, you'll have another non-lethal way to take down an enemy in addition to the prod. I get the idea. What's the first move? I'm going to give you a map of the island. If you can get to the north dock, a UNATCO informant will give you a key to the statue doors. He responds to the code phrase, iron and copper. You could avoid a lot of fighting, though, if you found a back way to the statue. I'll see how it looks on shore. Your primary objective is the makeshift command center the terrorists have installed at the top of the statue. But don't forget about Agent Herman. We think he's being held on the ground floor. What are my orders when I reach the command center? Interrogate the leader. We don't yet know why the terrorists would risk an open assault. Alright. Actually, do I have a... I don't think... No, I don't have a... I don't have a stun baton. Which I kind of wanted. But I have this for a melee weapon for now, at least. This is a lethal weapon, though, so I have to be very careful not to use it. So yeah, a lot is different in this game. You can apparently swap out uh, augmentations and shit. I read. I've read about or whatever. Um... And like, yeah, there's, you're gonna find like different changes here. I've never gone through this game, uh, fully. But yes, we're doing a tra we're doing a tranquilizer, uh, dart run. I'm very sad about that. 
Whatever. No. What's your take on the situation, Corporal? The bots have them bottled up, sir. We'd go right in if it weren't for the whole back order. How'd they get one of our agents? Gunter went rogue on us. When the order came, he wouldn't pull back. Now you get to bail him out. All right. Oh, time for Michael at stealth. <laughs> you know, this is gonna be a good one. Oh shit! What the fuck? What are you doing here? Fuck! Welcome aboard, agent. Yeah, thanks. Oh, uh, dude, you just ki okay? Stealth over. Whoa! Fuck! When did we get that? All right. They come this way. I got them, sir. Okay, <laughs> well, too down, guys. Hey, you know, you know what? I'm the one doing stealth. He doesn't have to do anything. What the hell's that combat? I already have a combat knife, I guess. Uh, or no, I have a better melee weapon. It says. That's what it does. So we we want the stun baton. Uh, I pronounce it weirdly, but we're gonna just have to deal with it. All right. What's this? What's this thing? Disposable plasma-based weapon. Next generation stealth pistol. Unfortunately, it means it fires a single shot. Uh, it's lethal under most circumstances. We'll keep it around for bots or, and things like that. Actually, it is a, it does say stealth weapon though. If you want to make a covert approach, remember the academy stealth course. Stay out of their field of view, walk slowly to stay quiet, and crouch behind cover. Or if you have to get your hands dirty, remember that a headshot is a lethal takedown. This used to have things on top, now it doesn't. Um... Oh. I guess they're here now. Okay, this is gonna be pretty interesting. Uh, so now, yeah, this is completely different, this game now. Uh, do we have a scope for this? No, we don't. Okay, well, there's one guy over there. Way out of range, though. Do I have a lean button? Oh, I do have a lean button. That's so janky, actually. <laughs> there's a guy right here. going to the bushes. So I've never really done a stealth run in this game, and I usually do, as I said, sniper rifles. Which I still will do. Uh, there's nothing to stop me, because you can put a silencer on that shit, so why not? Okay, let's try and get this guy in the head. This is why I maxed this thing out. Shit, he saw me. What the fuck? Oh, wait, I got him. I okay, he's just taking damage. Oh, that's not good. Luckily your friend- oh my god, I only have one shot left in this thing. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's do some stealthing. Oh shit. Like, I'm like seeing him go for me. I'm trying to stealth! It's something I've never tried in the history of anything. Alright. I'm thinking of doing charger on this guy. Maybe I should reserve the trank darts for something else. Okay. Uh, he's coming our direction. Try and move this guy over. Okay, where is he gonna go? Is that not suspicious at, at all to you? The, uh, the shit that's on the ground. Shut up, Jacob. Be careful. The NSF has set up patchwork security systems here. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Disaster. Stealth is fucking hard. Oh. That's him. He's a cop. He has a flamethrower. Alright. Alright, stealth is, <laughs> stealth is fun. I'm not sure why that robot didn't see me. Where was the guy that was running away from me? I think I kind of want to, you know, see what he's all about. We have pepper spray. Okay, so we have our first password, smash the state. Uh, so I guess the mini crossbow... Oh, it says you found some weapon... Oh, I didn't want to throw that around. Alright, so we found some darts. Apparently that didn't pick up immediately. I'm not sure why. I don't know. Wait, we have two rounds of knife. How does that work? I think we have an alt fire for it, maybe. One second, let me bind that. 
Okay, this may be a bit weird, but I've had to change this all. I remember there was alt fire, and I don't think I didn't. I didn't. Oh shit, son! Oh, dude, this is gonna be our melee weapon. Who am I kidding? Let's see what other melee weapons we. Uh, but uh, let me just save it in case something bad happens. Okay, this says doesn't have an alternate fire. This also does. What the hell? What are you doing here? Okay, we got him. Shit, the bot. Okay, bots do not care about people. Switching to whoops, I said switching to crowbar. Oh, oh I can you can throw the stun baton as well. That is so weird. Um, I'm gonna have to get really get used to that. Okay, we don't need this guy either. What's the pepper spray gonna do for me? I have absolutely no idea, but it's taking along. I do not want this thing though. We we don't need a pistol. Uh, I mean, knife is still a pretty good way of, uh, I mean, what's the damage on it? Uh, the damage on the baton is way higher. I'm not about killing them, uh, like, not killing them. I'm more about, as I said, uh, non-lethal. Yes, so. Just go, oh, yeah, that's right. I changed my key for that. Okay, he had some credits on him. All right. Grade security bot in this area. You can either avoid its patrol route or, if you're feeling lucky, try and take it out with the EMP grenades or explosives. I wouldn't recommend taking it on with small arms. Oh, wow. What the fuck even shot me? I think the bot may have seen me. Well, luckily, we did save it pretty close. Uh, yeah. Oh, wait. This, this, guy, he, this guy came back. All right, I should deal with him. This is definitely gonna be an interesting run. Let me let, let me tell you that right now. All right, so I have no grenades to open up the the box, and also that isn't that's very loud as well. But I don't know. Actually, maybe, maybe we can. Um, can I just can I pick his ass up? All right, let's uh, save it here. I'm gonna try something. Grade security bot in this area. You can either avoid its patrol route or, if you're feeling lucky, try and take it out with the EMP grenades or explosives. I wouldn't recommend taking it on with small arms. Okay, bot's over there. Huh? Oh, he's got a sniper rifle. Wow. Okay, that's what that's what got me last time. And that guy's just having the jitters. Yeah, we need to quit. Alright. The NSF put a commercial grade security bot in this area. You can either avoid its patrol route or, if you're feeling lucky, try and take it out with the EMP grenades or explosives. I wouldn't recommend taking it on with small arms. Yeah, he could just. This guy is like eagle eyes over here. Try and take him out with the dart, though. They found us. <laughs> That is super impressive, actually. Bot's still over there, though. Alright, they both got hit. What? Why can't- oh. I'm like, why can't I go past this? Let's take out the- let's get this guy. I think he had a- yeah, there you go. We just got our sniper rifle. We also got some goggles, too. And also my leg is completely fucked, so... There's like an invisible wall here. That's that's what I had trouble uh, on. Alright. That's actually... Okay, so this should give you a better idea of the difficulty that we're dealing with. Uh, so maybe it's actually good. Uh, okay, deck goggles. Let's actually have that maybe. And we're, have, we're gonna have the sniper rifle somewhere. Uh, we are gonna keep that with us. I don't even know why I still have that. I think I didn't drop it. Uh, we guess I can use the recoil mod on that, but I think I'll save it for the time being. This is already actually a pretty interesting run, I have to say. I, I, I didn't know quite what to expect with this game, but yeah. Uh, what do the goggles do? Oh, it's like light amp. Oh, I can't get rid of it. Okay, I just kind of wasted it, so let me just lo let me load it back, actually. You, you kind of just, it, it's a consumable, you use it, I forgot about that. I don't think I've ever used it. So I'm just having a look around here to see what kind of goodies there are. 
There's explosive barrel. We're also running out of, um, we're, we're completely out of, uh, tranquilizer darts right now. Oh, what does this guy have for me? Didn't find anything. I'm only using the stun baton because it is my best weapon. I think sword is pretty loud though, the sword in this game. Pretty fucking loud. Maybe not. Where'd the guy go? I'm actually super spooked right now. I, I thought I thought he was patrolling here. And this guy's coming over here now. Oh, there he is. Not a good place for me to be right now. We have, we have to wait until the other guy goes away. Is he going? Yeah, he's going. This guy's like walking around here. I didn't catch him when he did that and he didn't catch me apparently. Good fuck, kid. Alright, you guys want to see my amazing throwing knife capacity? Let's save it, because it's obviously that's how much faith I have it in right now. Where'd my sniper rifle go? I thought I put that in my inventory. Or is it because I loaded? This is... Mike Lat stealth right here. Now, apparently there's no aimer on this. Where Fuck. I heard oh, take him out. Let's get <laughs> what? Out here. what? Did he throw a knife at me? And then I just got fucking killed in one hit? And I was aiming at his head too. <laughs> Alright. Give, give him the good, good old stealth roo Again. Fucking got stuck on the park bench. What do you want me to do? How many fucking knives do you need? Get your ass back here. Yeah, I, okay, I threw like I I threw fucking five knives at his face. Okay, you don't get you don't get to live from that. Oh my god, he's fucking he, and he also runs like really fast. Uh, uh, got him. Not even close. All right, go over here. There's some things I want to pick up here. All right. Where's my stun? Okay, I got my stun baton back. Alright, so we are not doing a throwing knife run. Uh, I have just decided this. It all happened an hour ago. The barge docked and the NSF moved right on in, offloading the cargo into speedboats. Our undercover man, Harley Philbin, should be somewhere out on the docks now. I wish I had binoculars. Why don't I have binoculars? I must have missed them at the beginning. They must have changed their play where they were. Either that or we don't actually get binoculars. It's over there. I don't know. I don't want to go down here right now. Because I have- well, I do have one Trank Dart uh, clip. Apparently throwing knives sucks balls. I don't know when this guy's gonna turn. I, I gotta tell you, this is the first time I, I played a Deus Ex game like this. And my first reaction wasn't just to fucking sniper everything. Okay, I don't know what the sweet spot is for one hitting them, but whatever. Oops. I, I keep pressing that instead of F. I just like throwing things around, and also I'm really not used to it. Alright. I'm not sure why it does that thing where it just... I, I guess it... I guess it is giving me the ammo. I'm not sure. I, I gotta check that next time. My apologies if I'm not getting doing that right. And can we actually heal our uh, leg up? 
No, oh, well, actually we can. Just slightly, though. Actually, wouldn't be a bad idea. This is actually, this mod's pretty difficult, I have to say. Uh, we'll have a look over here, though. Because I don't know where anything is anymore. Oh, there's nothing really here. We need that health regeneration mod. I guess that medkit ability is now really good. For some reason. I'll take that. About time you showed up. Iron and copper. The statue is copper on an iron frame, right? Passwords enough, pal. Don't think you know something about the lady I don't. My dad did tours out here. I heard that you can get me inside. Depends. You get your man out, take back the statue, whatever. But I know the commander and I don't want to see him get hurt. Here's a picture so you don't make a mistake. You can trust me. I'll take your word. Here's the key to the front entrance. Commander's not much of a soldier. He'll surrender as soon as he sees you. I need him alive because he's my main contact at the NSF. If he's dead, I don't have much of a business. Thanks. Alright, what do we have here? Oh look, another combat knife. Uh, I think we're not doing the memeing of uh, throwing them at anybody as I've learned. Okay. Ship's wheel. Fuck, can I get up here? Okay, crouch jumping works. You with Philbin? I get a cut for bringing him over. Tell me what you know about the NSF operation. I'm not that high level. The more elite troops, they're the ones that took over the ship and unloaded it into speedboats. I think we're supposed to be a diversion. A ship? That's all I know. The commander gave me a 10 millimeter clip, a box of 30 aug 6 ammo, and some crossbow darts, and said, keep your head down. Huh. Like I'm gonna take on your NATCO troops. Want them? You can add the clip for 175, the 30 out 6 for 300, and the darts for 50. But if I was you, I'd avoid a head on attack altogether and not even use the key Philbin got. I'd go in the statue from the back. Less security that way. Alright, I'll take the darts. I'll give you 50 for the darts. The commander's the whole reason my neighborhood turned into a war zone. Somebody should stick him full of these things like a roast pig. I don't think I'm gonna need the sniper ammo though. And not, not, I don't seem to have a choice sure for it anyways. Buy some ammo? Oh, I can actually get it. I don't think I should get it though. Ah, eh, it's just 300. 300. Give me the 30 odd six ammo. Thanks. I mean, it's eight shots. What am I? What am I gonna need money for? What is my money account right now, actually? A one, a 155. So now we have nothing else that we can afford. We can't really use a sniper rifle until it's silenced. Otherwise, it'll attract way too much attention and. You guys have already seen that attracting way too much attention, in my case, has been really poor, or gone really poorly so far, so. The TNT box over here. Actually, there's a crate here. Why do I have a throwing knife in this slot? Oh, we got a rocket. Fuck! Why do I keep throwing all my melee weapons because I right-click? It's probably because I'm right-clicking. Just drink some of this. Get some, uh, HP back. Alright, let's see. Uh, we'll keep the throwing knives, though. I don't really feel the need to have this, uh, these knives anymore. I don't even need this, to be honest, uh, and we definitely don't need that. Alright, I think we're good now. Actually, why do I have another napalm flamethrower? <laughs> it's like, it's a big thing in the middle of my inventory, and I don't even know why I have it. Alright. Uh, so there are still those EMP grenades I can use to take out the bot, however, I can't avoid a head-on collision, uh, head-on engagement with them. But I still want to go down to to save Gunther, so yeah, we're gonna go through the back way, I guess. I think there's supposed to be someone doing patrol here. There he is. I'm doing sneaky, sneaky mic things. Uh, maybe I should sneaky sneaky somewhere else. Oh shit. Maybe I should mic lot him from above. Fuck, can I m not make it up here? Guess not. Yeah, we're gonna stay in the corner here. Yeah, let's let's throw a flare out. So it's okay, this is this is my tactic. I'll distract him. What the hell's wrong with that flare? 
Yeah. Ah, uh, I guess if I hit him like directly, fuck. If I hit him like directly in the back. Why does Thrag Knives keep going there? Keeps filling up my inventory with things I don't want. All right. It gives me one more dart if I uh, if I pick up the bow itself, which I think is weird. But I guess it's some kind of thing with the game. I guess. Oh shit. Hey, let's try the good old flare tactics. Okay, flare tactics didn't work. That's okay. We'll just come plot his ass. Just start using your code name, Prod. Who was that? I didn't see a uniform. Oh yeah, if you hit him in the back, it's it's actually the best place to hit them. Okay, we're good. This power box must have been damaged in the raid. Don't cross through the arcs. I'm also picking up an EMP field here. If you're not careful, it'll suck away your bioelectrical energy. So we can do things like this, where we just press the button, the forklift kind of comes up. Like, I don't even have to waste a multi-tool on this shit. Shit. Your hands are full. Destroyed my life. Fuck. I can't even see anything with that open. Alright. So what do we have here? A weapon modification laser sight. Alright, that actually might be really good for the, um... For the trank, uh, trank gun. Yeah, we can use it there. As I said, we'll, we'll upgrade that sniper later. I'm keeping it with me. We're not even gonna maybe... We're not even probably gonna upgrade snipers all the way, which is really weird for me to ever say that, so... Just assume I've been taken over by some alien presence and that, uh... I'm not Mike Lad right now. So this is a pretty good run so far. There are a lot of guys over there. But we'll do the stealth ro stealthy way of getting up here. No need to kill everybody. Yeah, something's definitely wrong with me today, I guess. Uh, what's in here? Oh, wonderful. Apparently I take a screenshot every time I turn on my light. Okay. I maybe should unbind that. I, I was wondering what that noise was. Now I'm gonna have like 40 screenshots of uh, Deus Ex because I keep doing that. Okay, well, oh, oh let's not drop that. Okay, we're taking the back way in, guys. I like how that flare is still going. Alright guys, we're gonna peace out here, so next time uh, we'll continue to go up uh, Lady Liberty here, so take care everyone, goodbye.